Now let's configure the wireless router in order to have a full connectivity between the laptop and uh, this wireless device. So the same thing, double click. We have uh, Linksys equipment. And as every equipment, we have this window with the physical device view and also a config tab and a GUI tab. It depends of the equipment, we have different tabs and different options, but all will have uh, a config tab and a physical view. Okay, so in the GUI, you have the real feeling of the equipment, or in the config, you can have just some uh, boxes you can where you can. Uh, basically configure the equipment we don't have the full configuration options here but we have the most important ones so let's take the internet setting the lan settings and the wireless so you can just choose uh, ssid here like test Packet tracer channel. We can put a password like test it at home. Let's copy it and that's it. Or we can do the same the same thing from here. You can go to wireless security and you see everything is already configured as as we as we saw. Okay. Let's go to the laptop and we have the physical view here, as you already are familiar with the config. We have basic config here. And we can choose where to connect to and some IP interface and so on. We have desktop, and we'll talk a bit a little later about it. And some we can add some custom software or services. Okay, let's go for now to PC wireless. It says it requires a different wireless interface, so We'll go and turn off, drag and drop this, and look for the, the other interface that is required. So let's drag it here. Drop it, turn it on again. Let's go back to desktop, PC wireless. And now we should be able to connect to the wireless network. Okay, connect will be required to type the password and connect. Adapter active. We have here the link information. You have successfully connected the network to the access point. Okay, that's it. And if we go here again, we should have already an IP address. So it's 192.168.0.101. So let's go back to the equipment and let's go to command prompt and try to ping the access point. So it works. So this is how you connect a wireless device to an access point and how to connect, basically uh, configure an access point.